this three day summit is very important for NATO, not only for this superstructure, but also for Europe and, of course, for the United States. Why? We have problems in Europe, we have problems in America, we have in America the presidential race, we have problems with the cognitive capacity of Joe Biden, at least in his party. And we have also problems in Europe with the elections in France, in uh, Germany, and in other places, but uh, they are considered as the core of the European Union. So the problem is important on both sides and we have to fix them. So the idea to have this 75th anniversary <coughs> right now for this world's biggest security organization at that time when we know that Russia presses its advantage in the problem with Ukraine on the battlefield in Ukraine, we can imagine that all um, the ideas will be essential to save people, to save innocent people, to save uh, integrity and to try to explain in a more clear way the task of NATO, which is not only the relation and the sum of the relations of the United States of America with Europe, is in fact something more complex. We have to define it and also to explain its duration because its strategy is relevant not only for those 32 states but also for the world of freedom and democracy. So we have to use this summit to clarify all this to define new tasks for the future and, of course, to fix the problems of Europe and America at the same time.